I was diagnosed with Tourette's syndrome at age six. Um, my uh, whole family has it, except for my mom, this is hereditary. And um, uh, I'm very fortunate to have gotten out of the New York City public school system alive. And the, the problem with Tourette's is that it is generally for the general population, it's uh, it's you're at its its height and worst around the age of 11 or 12, which is just a brutal age in general. So, um, but, um, you know, it made me uh, uh, thicker skinned. It also made me uh, uh, probably unconsciously become the actor that I am because I was always trying to act normal for people and and uh, and and hide it. And um, I wasn't open. Uh, I mean, I was. I told a lot of my classmates and certain. Uh, but I, you know, you you just it's not that comfortable to try to just expose yourself when you're that young. Um, and then when I was about uh, you know 19, it started to subside a little bit, which is interestingly enough uh, when I kind of fell into being an actor. And uh, I'm able to control it on camera. Uh, uh, I always tell people I can make a movie, but it's hard to watch one. Because when you're sitting still and watching something, that's when the, the, the Tourette's come out. Um, but when I'm focused with every bit of my being and having to hit these marks and say this stuff in a moat, um, uh, it quells the ticks for, for a time. Uh, my advice to a young kid who has Tourette's would 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 be to uh, tell people, tell people, be open about it, talk about it, uh, be honest. Uh, it's torture when you don't, and uh, you'd be surprised uh, when you completely let, you let yourself be visible in that in, in all realms. Uh, how. Uh, how accepting people can be, even young kids, uh, of of what's going on, because um, we all have empathy in us, and we all um, are capable of it. So I would just say, be you, and don't be shy, and let let everybody know that you know this is who you are, and um, we're all special in some way.